Mariner. Harbor's safe as it's going to get. You ever get a gnawing in your belly to do something crazy? Reason and sense keep steering you clear. Are you all right? People with serious medical conditions sometimes make rash decisions. It's nothing like that. I've been stealing myself to do this for years. Can't go putting it off anymore, can I? The Red Death. May have heard of it. The big monster lives beneath the waves. Only strikes when the fog is thick. People think it's some drunken sailor's tale. But no one goes sailing when there's a fog on. In their bones, they know there's something out there. Is there any evidence the Red Death is real? When I was a little one, I went sailing with my aunt. Fog rolled in thick and fast, and we saw it. Glowing red, crimson, an unholy light that stretched to the sky. My aunt was no fool. We rowed to shore with all our might. Tide made it hard, but we hit landfall. Yeah, I suppose the Red Death could exist. Good. An open mind. With my business here done, and knowing someone like yourself, I seek to end this unholy terror. Dozens of boats over the long years been claimed by it. I mean to hunt this Red Death. Are you with me? How do we go about this hunt? No one's encountered the Red Death up close and lived. But many folk have seen its glow from afar. I've been collecting the details of those sightings for years. We take our boats, and I can get us there. I know it. But it could be the deadliest challenge we ever face. So I'll understand if you pass. What's in it for me? Listen. I've thrown every cap I have into the hull. I'm close to beggar defending the harbor, but anything you find on the Red Death is yours. I just want to put it down for good. Count me in. Bring whatever weapons of death and mass destruction you got. Meet by the docks. You take your boat, I'll take mine. This trip is going to test our metal more than anything. the island catch you off guard by my guns. Big Chop's got everything you need. <laughs> my kids ain't gonna believe the stories about you. Mariner, please. I heard about this expedition of yours. We need you. Please, turn back. The whole strong. And one more rifle won't make a difference. Mainlander, if the Red Death's real, we can't afford to lose you both. Do you really think it's dangerous? Every now and again, some fool goes hunting for the Red Death. Sometimes they come back empty-handed, but more times than not, that's the last they're heard of. The hunt for the Red Death has taken its share of drunks, but it's also taken the lives of our mightiest men and women. Please, don't throw your life away. With all I've seen and faced, this Red Death doesn't scare me. Don't say you haven't been warned. Hey, you, Mariner. I'll meet you there. The Red Death is going down. size a boat of your size. I'll catch up to you. Not much further, Mainlander. 
Auntie Stacy told others of her brush with the Red Death, they laughed at her. Then two weeks after, a full fishing boat never came back. From the beach, they saw the glow on the horizon. I've been looking to end the reign of the Red Death's terror my whole life. Wrecks all around it. There. You see it, right? Meet you there, and get prepared. That's the Red Death? Are you sure this is it? It's got to be the red glowing eyes. I mean, when the fog's thick, that little fella is deadly in his own fashion. The shoals around here are treacherous. A middling captain with a might of curiosity would run aground for certain. And this far from shore? That'll end you. Think we can handle it? We could always call in the Marines. Oh, ha ha. What do we say to all the folk back home? I meant this to be my last great adventure. Instead, if we tell the folk back at town, I'll be a laughing stock. Would it really be that big of a deal? You've no idea how pig-headed and relentless harbormen can be. Or maybe you do. The story will be told for generations. Maybe we embellish a little. Or a lot. Make it the stuff of legends. I have little stomach for it. But it's better than the alternative. Let's go. I thought, I got this for you. Celebrate. I didn't think it would turn out like this. It wasn't supposed to be like this.
and the scourge of the seas. So, uh, we set sail. It was a terrible fight. So you killed it? Oh, yes, we did at yeah. that. It was good. quite the sight. Did you hear? They did it! The Red Death's no more. Did it take long? My grand figured it would take a mini nuke direct to the center of the eye to do it in. That would have worked, but we may do. The seas are ours again. We can fish in peace. Tell me, are you injured, Mariner? Are you okay? No. We managed to get through unscathed. Thank God. I thought for sure you were sailing to your graves. Here's to the heroes. Mariner. Seems like the end of the road. Every time we've talked, you've given me a lot to think about. I've been stowing away gear and supplies for a final journey into the deep. But after the lies, we make the decision even harder. So what's your plan? I'm working on it. I mean, at the end of it all, what's worth doing in the final days? What's worth leaving behind? Do what you can to leave a legacy. Something to be remembered by. I like the sound of that. <sighs> no matter what happens, or what goes down, you were a true friend. Is it the bait shop? Thank you.